Good faith, my ass. Wow, frustrated parents pleaded their case in very colorful ways before the San Diego County Board of Education just hours ago. They want to separate from Grossmont Union High School District. Tennis reporter Real Creighton is now in El Cajon with why residents say they paid millions in taxes for a new high school and they got nothing in return. Well, the meeting is about unification, but what it actually amounts to is divorce. Alpine residents fighting to form their own unified school district separate from Grossmont. They're all part of the same district for now, but the internal split has already happened. Each side offering up a blunt education about high school. The one Alpine residents Good faith, my ass. are furious they never got. And the Grossmont district promised to build the high school, but it didn't happen. Alpine doesn't have its own high school. Parents claim they were misled into voting for bond measures worth hundreds of millions of dollars for a new school. Grossmont officials argued a history lesson. Those bonds were approved with a trigger. The district having a certain number of students, and there's a reason a new high school never materialized. Grossmont has lost over 2,000 students since 2009. You don't build a school when you've lost one. 2,000 students is a high school. But it's this point made previously by Grossmont superintendent that agitated many that a newly formed Alpine Unified School District would isolate an already segregated white population, making them less diverse. Alpine is not a white segregated population. Grossmont School Board President told 10 News it's not about race, it's about money. If Grossmont can't afford a high school, how could Alpine? The major factor is funding. They're not that big of a district. In El Cajon, Riel Creighton, 10 News.